Hello people, this is the predicted paper for A-level maths paper 3, which is uh, statistics and mechanics. Okay, section A, statistics. Question 1. The number of pizzas sold and the temperature on 25 days is recorded. Part A, suggestional, an alternate hypothesis for a two-tailed test to investigate whether there is a correlation between the number of pizzas sold and the temperature. The product moment Correlation coefficient is calculated to be minus 0.72. Test your hypothesis at the 5% significance level. Question 2. The number of goals scored in 20 football matches are summarised below. Goals 0 to 1, frequency 11. Goals 2 to 4, frequency 7. Goals 5 to 6, frequency 2. Part 1. Use linear interpolation to estimate the median. Part 2. Estimate the mean. Part 3. Estimate the standard deviation. Okay. Question 3. The events A and B are independent and such that probability of A is equal to 3 times the probability of B and the probability of A and B is equal to 1 over 12. Part 1. Show that probability of B is equal to 1 over 6. Part 2. Find part A, probability of A union B, part B, probability of A dash union B dash, and part C, probability of A given B dash. Question 4. A company sells 75 cars every week. It is known that 6% of the cars are recalled for faults within the first 6 months. Part 1. Calculate using the binomial distribution the probability of recalling between 4 to 8 40 cars within the first 6 months. Part 2. Use a normal approximation to calculate an estimate for the probability of recording 4 to 8 40 cars within the first 6 months. Part 3. Calculate the percentage error found in Part 2. Okay. Question 5. A manufacturer claims that 10% of their bottles contain more than 335 milliliters and 20% of their bottles contain less than 327 milliliters. Part 1. Work out the mean and the standard deviation volume of the bottles. The manufacturer would like to adjust the standard deviation so that the mean is 330 milliliters and only 5% of their bottles contain more than 335 milliliters. Part 2. Calculate the standard deviation to two significant figures to achieve the above target. Question 6. A particular treatment for a disease has 0.65 rate of success. However, the hospital believes that the rate of success has recently changed. Part 1. Using a 5% level of significance, find the critical regions to test the above claim. Part 2. Find the actual significance level based on your answer to Part 1. In a recent study of 60 patients, only 25 have uh, successfully recovered. Part 3. Comment on the hospital's claim in light of this study. So total for section A is 50 marks and the section B uh, starts now. So section B is mechanics. So this will be question 7. A particle of mass 5 kg is moving under the action of a constant force F newtons. The velocity of P is 1 minus 3 sorry, i minus 3j meters per second at time t equals to 0, and 5i plus 2j meters per second at time t equals to 2 seconds. Find part 1, the speed of t at t equals to 0. Part 2, the vector f in the form ai plus bj. Part 3, the value of t when p is moving parallel to l. Question 8. A particle P is projected with u meters per second from, point, from a point A 8 meters above the ground. P is projected at an angle 30 degrees to the horizontal. The greatest height of P is 20 meters above the ground level. Calculate the value of u. Part 2. Work out the horizontal distance traveled by P before reaching the ground. Part 3. Calculate the time spent by P when it was 15 meters above the ground level. Okay, now question 9. The displacement of a particle P from the origin after t seconds is given by S equals t squared bracket t minus k meters. 
given that p is at instantaneous rest when t equals to 2. Find the acceleration of p when t equals to 5. Question 10. A particle p of mass 1.2 kg is on a rough plane inclined at an angle 35 degrees to the horizontal. The particle is held in equilibrium on the plane by the action of a force of magnitude 10 newtons acting up the plane in a direction parallel to the line of greater slope of the plane. The particle is on the point of slipping up the plane. Part 1. Calculate or find the coefficient of friction between P and the plane. Part 2. The force of magnitude 10 newtons is removed. Find the acceleration of P down the plane. Question 11. A plank AB has mass 30 kg and length 5 meters. A load of 15 kg is attached to the plank at B. The loaded plank is held in equilibrium with AB horizontal by two vertical ropes attached at A and C. The plank is modelled as a uniform rod and the rod as a particle. Given that the tension in the rope at C is two times the tension in the rope at A. Calculate part 1, the tension in the rope at C, and part 2, the distance CB. Again, the total for section B is 50 marks, and total for the paper is 100 marks. And best of luck, the solutions will be posted in about 3-4 days.